Hola, and welcome or welcome back to Kim at Home. I have so many different things that I'm gonna do in today's video, starting off by setting up my office. If this is your first time here, welcome, welcome. I am Kim, K-Y-M. Thank you so much for tuning in. I do appreciate that very, very much. Before you leave out, please do not forget to hit subscribe as well as the like button. By doing so, it shows YouTube that people actually do like to watch my videos, even though they don't like to push them out. I'm just saying. I did not read one direction and I got that set up, so that's super exciting. Now I gotta work, okay, bye. <laughs> For my birthday weekend, I traveled to Pennsylvania and I went to my uncle's flea market. Now this flea market was like covered in stuff from head to toe, but once you have like the opportunity to go by sections and I only had about 25 minutes, you will find some great gyms in there. I had to let him know like, you know what, if you lived here in Columbus, you would make a lot of money because there's some great antiques that you have in here. So since I only had 20 minutes, I wasn't able to get all of the items that I wanted. I plan to go back. It's only a two hour and 50 minute drive from me. But yeah, I did get some great stuff and I will show you what I got along the way. By the way, this is real crystal and it is extremely heavy. Let me know below in the comments if you enjoy thrift stores and antique stores and if you want me to film any of that because I definitely will. One thing I will say is I felt like I was wiping off 100 years of dirt and dust <laughs> from all of these items. I was just cleaning them off with vinegar as well as some Mrs. Meyers dish soap. Some of these items were super, super, super dirty, so they did require some Dawn power wash. I'm a firm believer in there needing to be some sort of conversation piece in your decor, which is why I picked up this bike. It is so cute. And I also have an old school rotary phone. Let me know below in the comments if you had a rotary phone when you were younger.
husband and I are trying to decide what color I should spray paint this phone. So if you have any suggestions, please leave them below in the comments. How are all of you doing today? What have you been up to? What are you watching? What are you reading? Right now, I just finished a show on Netflix called Champion. It is so good. So if you are into like music scene, that sort of thing, definitely check it out. I still have a few books on my shelf that I need to read that I haven't just yet, but I definitely will get around to it. Life has just been real busy lately. Like I feel like I don't have time to breathe. This day right now happened to be about 72 degrees outside. It was super, super nice. I ended up just taking out some of the dead plants and that sort of thing that I had in my flower bed and I'm just going to plant some bulbs. When I tell you that gardening is extremely peaceful, it definitely is. Even if you feel like you don't know what you're doing, just do it anyway, just have fun. The whole point in me planting flowers is I like pretty things. I like to look at pretty things, they make me happy. So it doesn't have to be anything like that's perfect or anything like that. It just has to be like, you know, Kim pulling up in the driveway like, oh, look how beautiful they are. And they're always a conversation piece because for some reason I'm the only person who typically plants. Our homeowners association definitely needs to step it up because our property seems a little bit plain. <laughs> I know in a previous video I had mentioned how my car, her name is Maxie. Maxie has been giving me some problems, y'all, okay? And my family wants me to break up with Nissan, so I'm like trying to mentally process that. <laughs> I know it sounds crazy, but this is my second Maxima and this is my fifth Nissan. And I really do like Nissans. They give you all the bells and whistles. I never ever thought that I would have an issue with change, but change isn't easy for people and now I realize that. I thought about this quote I read regarding change and it says, don't be afraid to give up the good to go for the great. So I'm gonna speak some good things into my life. I'm gonna say, you know what, I'm gonna get a car. It may not be a Nissan and it's gonna be great. It's gonna be better than my Maxima. It's gonna be fully loaded bells and whistles and I'm not gonna to have to be paying like $500 a month for a car payment. That is why I have not gotten a new car. This car is a 2010 and homegirl has been doing me right up until recently. So this change is gonna be good for when that time comes and hopefully it's not for another like three years or so. <laughs> Since I did get some new items, I wanted to change some things around a little bit in the kitchen. Now you guys just saw a marble cutting board that I was kind of cleaning off. And I got that from the at home store. The at home store has a sale going on right now and everything is like 50 to 75% off. Plus I had a birthday coupon. So I got a marble cutting board for dun dun dun, $10, okay? I don't even think it was $10. I think it was $8.99 to be exact. 
It's so funny because sometimes when my husband goes to the store with me, he dreads it because like I always want to go to the home decor stores, right? So this particular day, he decided to stay in the car. So I'm like coming out of the store as fast as I can because you know your girl can't run yet, but I'm gonna be running this summer, hopefully. Anyway, <laughs> I get in the car with him and I'm like, let's pull away, let's hurry up. I just got to steal. I think I might've stole it, even though I rung it up. I don't know because I got <laughs> the marble cutting board and a little plant to go with it. And it all came out to be $12.99. This little contraption I'm cleaning off right here is marble too. Not really sure what to call it. So I'm gonna call it a contraption, okay? At any rate, this was $5.99. Then I got an all white marble candy dish for $2.99. Let me tell you something. If you ain't hip to the at-home store, I'm gonna need you to get your life together because they always have some great items in there. I think my heart just skipped a beat. Yeah. This fit plan is getting so strong. Let me till the morning, let me all night long. There's something special about I've been on the hunt for a lamp for this living room for, I don't know, a year. Let's talk about how indecisive Kim is. Well, no, let's save that for another day. At any rate, since I have not been able to find another lamp, I decided to pick up some additional crystal, which I was so glad that, like I said before, I went to my uncle's flea market because this is beautiful right here. I absolutely love it. Typically people would use it as a candy dish, but I just wanted to use it as decor. Not to mention it matches perfectly with the lamp. In my home, there are no rules for decor. I'm gonna use whatever I want, wherever I want, however I want, if it looks good, you know? <laughs> I have absolutely no rules at all whatsoever. I get a high every time we kiss. Can't get enough, baby. So come give me love. All of your love. Won't you love me to the morning? Love me in the evening. You know what I want. Won't you hold me like I'm yours? Show me that I'm yours. You know just what I want. Won't you love me like the last time? Like a time was right now. Show me what it's about. Love me to the morning. Love me in the evening. You know what I want. I know I'm yours, baby. So come give me love. You know you're mine, baby. So come give me love. I never felt nothing quite like this. I get a high every time we kiss. Can't get enough, babe. So come give me love, all of your love. Won't you love me till the morning, love me in the evening, you know what I want. Won't you hold me like I'm yours, show me that I'm yours, you know just what I want. Won't you love me like the last time, like a time was right now, show me what it's about. Love me till the morning, love me in the evening, you know what I want. All of your love. Thank you so much for being here. I truly, truly appreciate you. Don't forget to love on yourself, give yourself grace, and know that you are worthy, you are enough, and you are capable of doing anything that you set your heart to. I really, really need you to believe that because if you don't believe it, there are certain things that are going to happen in your life. There are certain ways you're going to allow people to treat you, and you deserve so much better than that. I really hope that you've had this opportunity to go on this healing journey with me, just getting your mental health together, your emotional health together, everything else will fall into play, but it definitely starts from the inside. It has been extremely liberating. I'm laying down at the compartment. I see you in the wild Cause this time I will choose you Yeah I'll choose You know exactly how to look like this Holding in a bag full of goods and needs I need a night like this Knowing it's a risk cause you're using it You've got all your secrets I can seem to move this thing Oh no. 
this shark vac mop oh my gosh that was a tongue twister <laughs> All I put in there was some vinegar. That's the only thing that I will clean my floors with. My husband always threatens that he's gonna clean the floors with something else. And I'll be like, listen, you mess with my floors and I'm gonna flatten your tires. <laughs> I'm just joking, calm down. Gosh, have a sense of humor. But yeah, I just put some vinegar in here and let me tell you something. Not only does it disinfect the floors, it really gets up all the grime in the dirt. Thank you so much to my girl, Millie Vanilli. <laughs> she's more like family for real for real I've known her forever um, for gifting this to me because I really really do love it Thank you again for being here. I really can't say it enough. I am truly, truly appreciative. Look how dirty my floor was. Now I'm just gonna work on this living room, get the floor vacuum. I love to see a good vacuum line, but this is really how I reset my home. You saw me in three different outfits because I don't do it all in one day. I'm a very detailed cleaner, thanks to my Aunt Mary, who shares the same birthday as me, rest with God. I love you so much and I'm so thankful that you showed me how to manage my home. For me, cleaning is just more than having a clean home. I have anxiety, so it really, really helps me with my anxiety. Whatever you're going through mentally, my suggestion would be find something that you like to do and do it as much as you possibly can. I know for me, when I'm feeling anxious, if I start cleaning something, I feel better because I completely forget about it. Which is why you should never judge a person for having a dirty home or a clean home because you don't know what they're going through. If you enjoyed today's reset, please don't forget to share it with someone. Um, it might bless someone, you just never know. There is way more substance to this video than just cleaning. I hope all of you have an amazing week and don't forget to love on yourself. Be sure to say your affirmations and look in the mirror when you say them. for rent. I just love harassing him.